welcome if you are new here or welcome back if you have been here before. I am Freya, this is Budgie Budgets and it's savings challenge day. Whoop, 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 whoop. Um, we only have $50 to work with today. <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Let's see how far we can make this stretch, you guys. And I've just realized I have got nothing organized. Oh goodness. Okay, give me a second. Okay, hopefully we are a bit more organized now. So first of all, I wanted to show you these are the crystal binders that are going to go up as like oopsie binders, basically. Um, so this is the original one that I printed. This was printed on my old printer. Um, I don't have one of the new ones that have gone out just yet, but it, the color scheme is very much like this. The details are a lot more crisp like this. Um, in everything like in in <laughs> like it's it's just much nicer but the color scheme is very much still similar it's still that very pastely look um yeah whereas as you can see on this one it's uh look it's a lot more true to life the color the coloring um but it's a lot more muted so it's a bit darker it's a bit moodier um and i just decided that it's not quite in line with the listing that I put up, which is photographs of this one, basically. So um, I am going to be listing these up. There's nothing wrong with them as such. It is literally just a change in color. And realistically, it's only the front and back covers that are the most impacted. So I will show you um, just so that you can, I might just move that out of the way for a second, just so that you can see some of the, oh, it's a bit hard because I've got money in here. Um, but what are you? Labradite, right? So let's find that one. Just so that you can kind of see. So that's that one. You can see the colors are quite, I mean, not quite different, but a little bit different. So it's like that throughout. They're not major differences. As I said, the front cover is most definitely the biggest difference. Um, obviously, I have not like hole punched these or finished them off yet, um, but I certainly will. What's this one? Uh, Kyanite. So that's this one here. So yeah, as you can see, just the general vibe is much darker. Um, yeah, and more detailed, I suppose, the print. This, the, the front is the same. And I just realized I shouldn't have shown you guys the front because that's got the amounts on it. Um, hopefully you weren't paying attention. So um, yeah, I will list these up. They will be slightly discounted. Not massively discounted because there's nothing wrong with them it's just a it's just a design choice on my behalf um, so there will be one 5k one available and one two and a half k one available you can still choose if you want um, scratch offs and cards with them um, that will still definitely be an option uh, this is the two and a half k one that I have available as well it's exactly the same so it's just that the whoops no that's not the front cover Hold on, let me find it so that I'm not showing you all of the amounts because I moved them all from my one. <laughs> Just in case you want it with scratch-offs. Okay, so the 2.5K one has a slightly different cover. But it's the same thing. It's just not the pastel vibe. It's just a bit of a moodier, darker vibe. So they will still come with everything. They will still come with their little clip. Um, yeah, and an IOU. And then if you want it, um, they will come with cards and scratch offs um so i will be listing them on in the store on thursday i think it's thursday september 19th at 7 p.m they will go live in the etsy store um there is only one of each so once they're sold they're sold i'm only selling them now because they're already pretty much made there's not a lot more that i have to do on them uh to get them posted out i will relist the crystal binders at some point but probably not until after christmas you guys I will see how I go with orders. I know I've got some people waiting on envelope orders, so I want to post those back up. Obviously, I'm going to be working on Christmas advent calendars as well. Um, and I have some big orders in for placeholders at the moment too. So I just want to get through all of those and then I'll see how I'm going for time. If I can possibly relist them before then, I will not in the same kind of volume that I listed them this time, um, but I will relist them. There will always be a bit of a longer run time on making these just because they take that bit longer to create. So um, especially if they need scratch offs and stuff. I don't know, guys, how many scratch offs I have stuck down over the last couple of weeks, but it is literally like it must be getting close to 
in the thousands at this point because it's several hundred scratch drops per um per binder um so yeah it's a lot it's a lot of scratch drop stickers but anyway nonetheless um those are the two that will go up so thursday the 19th of september if you are happy with those muted colors they will be slightly discounted um and they will go up for sale um so keep that in mind if you are after a crystal binder and the other version will go up sooner than later um well, no, not sooner than later, later than sooner, probably just given the rest of the workload that I've got on and the possibility of my going back to uni at the start of October. I'm still on the fence, you guys. I can't, I can't decide. I really can't decide. Um, okay, so let's get stuck into some savings challenges. Um, let's just change over. Let's just start with five budgie bucks. Let's see how far we can stretch this $50, you guys let's hope we can stretch it far um now i think i think i'm just going to do a five into here again um just because hopefully later in the month and certainly next month before our rent increase goes through i should have some extra money to play with in here because i've already budgeted for the rent increase um starting in october even though it doesn't actually start until november so I was like, it'll be yes, a sneaky little way to get some more money into our savings challenges and sinking funds um, before we actually have to face the reality of that. Okay, you guys, we have shut the box. I really hope I don't regret putting this back in here, but you guys all wanted to see it. Um, so I've got my big mama one here, which may make a return. Um, but you know, I'm all about supporting those other ladies in the biz. So custom budgeting had a sale a little while ago and I got my little hands on this one. Um, so it was a little digital download. It's mermaid shut the box. It's just a little one. So it should, it won't take long to complete. So either what I'll do is complete this one and then reallocate and then start the big mama or I'll finish this one. I won't reallocate and I'll do the big mama one. We'll roll them together. Either way, this is just something pretty. It's just something different, you guys. It's my color scheme, you know? And it's supporting another another mama. So we're all about it. We are all about it, aren't we, Budgie? Stay. Okay. Let's shut the box. Oh, what colors am I gonna use? Let's let's color. Let's we'll cross off in black and then uh, I'll have a think about what color we should color them in. Whoa! Okay, we're starting with a five. We want to knock out some big ones here. Because otherwise this money's not going to go far at all. <laughs> Six. Woohoo. Four. Uh-oh. Come on. Three. Oh, dear. Oh, you guys. Come on, something big. Four. Five, six, seven. Okay. An eight or a nine would be nice. Oh. Okay, a nine. Phew. Okay, guys, we're good. We can breathe. <laughs> we're good. Ooh. Five. Okay, that's it. We're out. That's us done. Um, is it weird if I do pink on pink? Maybe I should do like a bluey color. I don't think neon blue is not going to show up on this. Hey, let's do this one. So we've got eight, nine, ten, eleven going into... Mermaid shut the box. Cutie cute. Oh, I'm glad I only put five in the <laughs> I'm glad I only put five in the winter challenge. Not winter challenge. In the spring challenge. Oh you guys, my brain feels like someone took to it with a potato masher. I'm gonna come back to this because this is just gonna be a catch-all. So I've made it all ones and twos, and it is just gonna be to try and avoid an IOU. That's the vibe. Um so Let's do Twister. I'm really nervous about this one, actually. Yellow. Six. Oh, ouch. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We're just going to do one. We're just going to do one. Because I made these ones a little bit higher. But hopefully it will mean in the end the challenge is worth a bit more. So that, that'll be good. Okay. So we've got 10, 15, 16, and 17 in Twister now. And, um, where have I put this challenge? Give me a sec, you guys. 
Sorry, I need to step away while I'm still talking. That's naughty. There it is. Okay. This one is Rock and Bowl, and this is from Mum Wife Budget Life from Amanda. Is this? Oh, it's in my hand. This is the ten sided, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see how we go. None. Mm, <laughs> none, you guys. I don't think I want to put none in there. I mean, yeah, no, but let's just roll. <laughs> let's just be cheeky and roll the smaller dice then. One, two, three, four. All right, I know, cheaty, cheaty, don't care. Okay, we've got a one already in here, so let's take that out and put, whoops, put in a five. So we have 10, 15, 20, 21, and 22 in that one now. Our little rock and bowl. I know I'm not doing right. I know I should roll again to try and get a spare, but you know what? Um, I just want to play more games. <laughs> That's what it is. Um, let's do... Do I need to do them in order? What do you think, you guys? Let's do... Should we do bingo? Hmm... Should we do Skelly Lovers first? Hmm. Oh my goodness, what a mess I am. Okay, let's do let's do bingo. Uh, so green across the top, purple down the side. So one and five. Oh, of course. Of course I got the biggest one. Ah, goodness. Okay, so 15 in that one now. <laughs> oh dear why are these challenges always pranking me okay this one the highest we can get is a five let's see how we go yellow is a four okay have we got a one in here we do so let's put that one in and take a five so save the rainbow now has 20 25 30 31 and that's a save 100 did i cross that off Oh, I can't remember. Guys, I'll check later. And if I haven't, I'll come back and cross it off. All right. So we've done those two. Let's play. Let's play Scaly Lovers. Okay. So what I did decide is that I am going to work through the book. I am. I am. I am. Yeah, I am. I'm going to work through the book. So I'm just going to do, I think I'm going to do one on every challenge as I go through and then start again back at the start because I want this to save up for something big anyway. I think I'm going to use this either for uh, like my 40th, which is more than a year away um, or a holiday or something like that. I'm going to use it for something like that. So let's start snakes and skellies so help frankie get home to his mom roll a die move the amount of spaces rolled and save that amount but watch out for snakes okay so we've got a saved amount and we've got land on a snake and pay um shall we make it i think i'm gonna make it five so land on a snake and pay five yeah let's do that all right, let's go. So one, two, three, four, five. Just a one for today. We like it. Okay, cool. And then let's do one of these as well. I'm really excited to try these, you guys, because these are scratch-offs that Danny makes herself, and I'm so fascinated. Okay, so six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. How stinking cool is that? I'm a little obsessed. Okay, so our little meditate Let me just get my vacuum. Our little meditate dude is worth one. He's been very nice to us today. Oh, that is so cute. They're so cool. They scratch really nicely. Ooh. Okay, so $5 words and $10 words. Um, shall we do... Let's do one word and then we'll call it for this one. Um, maybe in 
It would make $5 words pink. Okay, so we're going to find one of these. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, you guys, if this, oh no, I've just seen one. I was going to say, if this takes too long, I am going to speed you up. Okay, so we've got Wicked for five. Have I got money in here? Oh no, I only have a 20 in there. Hold on. We are going to, I don't even know if you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm sorry if you can't. I'm just making some change. Okay. So a five dollar word. So today we are adding five, six, and seven dollars into our scally lovers, which gives us twenty-seven in there so far. Yeah, I think that's gonna be fun. Then we get to play all the different challenges. Each week we can do like a couple on a couple. Oh, this is the sticker one. That's exciting. That'll be next week. Oh, I love this so much. It's so cool. I think another way to do it would just be to have a whole binder dedicated to it, hey, and have an envelope for each one. That would be cool too. I really shouldn't be adding any more binders to my lineup though. <laughs> I think I might have enough. All right, roll it up. What have you got for us today? Let's see. I always feel like I have to use the dice that Jen gave me for this one. <laughs> okay, a three. We can live with a three. Where's my purple? Uh, oh, no, we've already done three. Okay, shall we do... Let's do two and one. Because then it's still three. Okay, one, two, three. What have I got in here at the moment? Let's have a little look. One, two, three, four, and five. So let's... Oh, my goodness. Let's take those and put this one in. Uh, okay, so five. So we've got 50, 70, 80, 85, 86, 87. And do you know what? I'm going to do another two. Cheaty, cheaty. Don't care. Let's do it because then we're close to another 25. And then we'll have 100. That's exciting because then we'll be able to mark off the next one. That's so cool. Okay, so 50, 70, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93, 90. Is that right? 50, 70, 80, 85. Oh, Freya. 86, 87, 88, 89. There we go. Nearly at 90. Just getting well ahead of myself, you guys. All right, so let's pop that back in there. Whoops, let me move that over here so you can actually see what I'm doing. Awesome. And we'll pop this in here. And then what have we got left? One, two, three. Okay, so with three, we will do some jelly beans. So let's do a purple one since we've already got that out. And what else? Maybe a blue one. And that starts us off with $3 in here. So this will just be a little one, but yeah, it's just a little, I just thought it might be handy to have a little, little one in here to catch all the odd dollars. So then I don't wind up with IOUs all the time because my brain does not do well with IOUs. It forgets they exist. Awesome. Okay, you guys, that is $50 done and dusted and everything, everything got some love, didn't it? Didn't it? Yeah, it did. Yay. Cool. Okay. Happy with that. All right, you guys have an awesome day. Thank you for spending some time with me on this Friday. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. I hope the weather is beautiful. Let me know what you're up to over the weekend down below. And I will see you on Sunday for my weekly budget with me. And you can help me rummage through and try and find the $288 I need to cover the cost of the bloody lawnmower and a whippersnapper. Ugh. What feral things to have to spend money on. Um, I'm also going to have to rustle up some cash because I think I am going to take my son and daughter out to the movies for his birthday. Uh, and I have not budgeted for that yet. So we're going to have to find that money too. So I will see you guys on Sunday for that. Okay. I love you. Bye-bye.